Now, for many, Christmas parties are still in full swing. Despite the cold and wet, people up and down the country are heading for nights out with friends and work colleagues. But more often than not, personal safety sometimes gets forgotten about. Well, one local police, fire and crime commissioner has come up with an idea to help. Northamptonshire's Stephen Mould has designed a customised van where... If you're feeling vulnerable, you can get some respite. You'll also be able to charge your phone, get some water, warm up, and even get some basic first aid if you need it. Our East of England reporter Amelia Harper has the story. Safer nights out. That's what police in Northamptonshire are trying to guarantee. A new minibus service to provide a safe haven for people who could be in trouble has just hit the streets. The Safer Nights Out van will be around on Friday and Saturday night from 10pm to 5am, staffed by vetted volunteers. We've got the bottle lids to stop the spiking. We've got the other ones for that go on top of the glasses with the straw hole in. We've got flip-flops for people who have lost their footwear. Um, foil blankets to keep people warm. Personal uh, purpose alarms. Sit bags and gloves. Wind up torches, first aid kit if you need to do any first aid for people out there. Northamptonshire Police has seen an increase in women being targeted as the nighttime economy reopened during the pandemic. Funded by the Police Fire and Crime Commissioner, the scheme comes amid a wider emphasis on women's safety. For me, one of the things that I particularly hold in the force to account and actually is make sure that, God forbid, that someone is a serious sexual assault or, or rape, that actually we support them in those prosecutions. Part of why Safer Nights, the Safer Nights Out van is here is to actually prevent it from happening. Adam Ward is a superintendent from Northamptonshire Police. Unfortunately, there is a minority that do come out and they are predators. And we have seen, and of course it's been in the, in the media regular, uh, uh, recently, um, an increase in propensity for targeting young women and girls. Um, and as a result of that, um, North Hans Police have been working to change the way in which they um, provide policing services so we can help protect the vulnerable people. Police are also working with local businesses to minimise crime against vulnerable people in their venues. While back on the streets, the volunteers will be out and about in the town, making sure people return home without harm. Amelia Harper, GB News, Northampton.